we just pulled them out of the, the, the ravine. It happens within seconds. This is why it's so dangerous right now to be out. It's unbelievably out. Come on, sir. Let's get you up okay. in, into the dry. Well, hey, uh, I want to thank these guys for saving my life. Thank you. Where are you from, buddy? Winnie, Texas. Winnie, Texas. So you yeah. guys have been hit pretty hard in Winnie, Texas. Yeah. What's your name? Jerry Sumrall. Jerry, somebody needs to come and get you. That CNN reporter just saved a guy after his truck fell into a ravine full of water. Wow, what a hero. But, but, but wait, something's about this footage. It doesn't add up. Look at this. Oh. Get out, dude. You got it. You got a, you got a, uh, a, a power cord? You got a rope? Yeah. Give me, give me, give me, give me. It's not that long. Hold on, I'm trying to get you a rope. All right, buddy, come on, get up out of that water. No, don't, don't, don't fall backwards. You all right? Take it. No, no, ma'am. No, ma'am, we got a car in a ditch. We just Hold on, back that clip up. Hold on. Wait, so here he's wearing khakis and sandals. And now, when he's pulling the guy out of the truck, look, he's wearing boots and pants. He completely changed his clothes between the edits. Either this reporter's name is Clark Kent, and he can change his clothes in a second and leap over a tall building. He took several minutes while the guy's truck was floating away, putting him in danger so he could make sure his khaki shorts and sandals wouldn't get wet. Or this whole thing is staged. Who knows? Could that guy in the pants be a stunt double? Given that this is the Clinton News Network putting this up, who was also caught staging a Muslim protest for peace, well, I'll let you decide. And there's also this bit right here. Now put yourself in that position. Winds howling, rain falling, then a truck drives into a flooded ravine. While it didn't fall in, it's still pretty freaking loud. You'd be startled. You'd turn your head like whoosh. And with this guy, it's just... ...that quickly. And if no one was here, if nobody was out doing a live shot, that fellow would be... He'd be gone. I can see just the top of his truck from my vantage point right now. Uh, no, you can't. The only thing that's floating away are the tattered remnants of your credibility. But maybe I'm wrong. I mean, this whole thing was staged. It's obvious to me, but I could be wrong. I have my hypothesis, but what is my null hypothesis? Maybe they edited for time. Maybe he put the khakis and boots on hastily in less than a minute over what he was already wearing. If so, Show me the raw, unedited footage. Until then, until CNN proves me wrong, well, CNN? Still fake news! You are fake news.